What's up guys, Casual Fragrance here, it's Chris. I'm gonna show you uh, set my ride, uh, my car. No, I don't have a Tesla, but hopefully it'll be coming soon and if I do get it, you guys will be the first to find out. Let me show you my car and my three fragrance scents. So let's go. This is a Ford 2012 SE, all black. Four door car. So let's go inside and check out my fragrances. My number three fragrance is from the house of Moogler. This one here is a fresh and clean uh, soapy fragrance. If you follow my channel for a while, you, you know how I feel about fresh and clean soapy fragrances. And this one here takes to cake. It's a fragrance that doesn't have the best projection longevity, which we'll get to in a moment, but it's something you can wear anytime. I use it as an air freshener in my car sometimes. I wear it to work a lot just to be on the safe side. And my number three is Moogler Cologne. Moogler Cologne is just a fragrance that any guy, any girl can wear it. It's a unisex fragrance. It's fresh. It's clean. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just, it's just fresh and clean. A soapy fragrance you can wear day in and day out. Nobody's going to be offended by it. If you're not really into fragrances but you want to take a little step forward into wearing a fragrance, definitely check this one out here. Uh, projection for me, I'm getting about uh, outward so out a lot it's just very like bubble around you. you'll get for that first hour people walk past you they'll get whiffs of if you're talking to somebody in close uh center centery you'll definitely they'll definitely get whiffs of this fragrance here in close encounters what i mean and i apologize and uh, longevity wise where it kind of falls short i'm getting about four to five hours on my skin it's not the the best but it's something where four to five hours you're going to smell fresh and clean and people around you are going to feel safer out. You're going to want to interact with you and talk to you. You're not going to be Mr. Cologne guy at work or somebody that has fragrances that every time he walks in the room, nobody wants to talk to him. And this is a fragrance that's safe for anybody. A girl, a boy, a man, a gentleman, teenager in high school. The list goes on and on. So if you're looking for something safe for around 50 to 60 bucks and you don't want to wear Axe or Dollar Store fragrances or body, body spray crap, definitely check out Mugger Cologne. My number three. My number two fragrance is from the house of John Barbados. You know about John Barbados fragrances. They don't have the best performance, but they do smell really good. I wish they had better performance. They have a good amount of great fragrances. I just recently heard they went bankruptcy, so I'm not sure where the company's going, whether it's gonna get bought by somebody and work out things or go downhill. Nevertheless, if you want one, definitely go pick them up. They're really cheap, around 20 to 40, 50 bucks. And the one I have here, I got for 25 bucks. This is John Barbados. Artisan. This one here is about 25 bucks and it's uh, I think 2.5 ounce and it's fresh, it's clean. It's something that I just reapply all over because it's one of those fragrances that don't last. I've had this conversation with a subscriber, Jerome, um, shout out to Jerome and or Pusher. It doesn't really last. It's a fragrance that I get about 30 minutes to 60 minutes of projection, if that. And I'm doing about eight sprays, so I'm like constantly spraying trying to make it last uh, about eight to ten sprays I know that's crazy but it does a weak performing fragrance but it smells good for that hour or so of projection it smells good longevity where it falls short it's a very fresh clean citrus fragrance very soapy fragrance which I I feel the same way a lot of other viewers say it's very fresh clean soapy fragrance and it's really good but it does lack the performance I mean four to five hours to some people might be good some people might say it's horrible but I mean for a freshy four to five hours is in that range of okay it's, it's average it's something that I have to bring this or reapply or bring a travel atomizer and just reapply it throughout after five hours at work reapply it again you'll get through your eight hour day or a ten hour day whatever amount of hours you work ladies and gentlemen it's a $25 fragrance get it for your son if he's getting the fragrances hey get it for your uh, kid that's going to college um, whatever if you want your boyfriend to smell fresh and clean not smell like you know weed or smell like beer definitely check John, John Verbatos Artisan it's a really it's a great dumb reach fragrance too it's fresh and clean maybe you don't want a heavy base fragrance like your Sauvage or Blue Day Chanel uh, maybe you just want something more calmer just fresh and clean that doesn't have a heavy Embroxen vibe a heavy patchouli vibe or oud based fragrances this is very safe to wear any guy or girl can wear so yes this could be unisex fragrance so is Mugu Cologne 
So if you move for something different and you want to step out of the box of Axe and Dower, Dower Store fragrances, like I said before, check out Artisan by John Verbatos. Last one on the list. Man, this one here, I like it a lot. I bought it recently a couple months ago and I blind bought it, which is crazy. Don't go blind buy stuff, but if you feel like you can, can afford to waste 50, 60 bucks and blind buy it, go right ahead. But I will never give you the thumb up to go spend 60, 70 dollars on a blind buy. This one here is from the House of Mooger. I like the bottle presentation. Um, pick up a bottle if you like these type of notes that I'm gonna go over. Cause some of these fragrances get discontinued. It has a star on it, so you already know what I'm talking about, baby. Mooger, Crypto Mint. Crypto Mint is a beautiful fragrance. It's uh, very fresh, with a uh, very fresh blast of mint in the opening, but it does have some calm down with some patchouli that gives it that sweet chocolatey vibe or Girl Scout vibe. So if you're in the mood for a very fresh, uh, minty fragrance in the opening, but then it calms down to more of a patchouli, sweet kind of vibe. Definitely check this out. I wear it to work and people at work like it, which is awesome. You know, nobody has said anything negative. I know a lot of women at work like this fragrance off me. They say it's very sweet and it's just, they like it. So that's awesome. And you know, I mean, I always like when people give me comments, but if I don't get them, it's not the end of the world. You know, I'm not expected to walk into a room and get thousands of comments. You know, I'm you know, that's just how life is. You just you buy a fragrance because you love to wear the fragrance, point blank. Once the comments come in, that's a plus, but that's not why I wear fragrances. That's why that's not my reason. I love wearing this fragrance because I love the note of the mint and that sweetness with, with the patchouli. Gives it that Girl Scout cookie kind of vibe and it's good. Like I said, projection wise, it's better than the other two. I just want to get about two hours of projection. Um, depends on how many sprays I do, about maybe five sprays and longevity, I'm getting seven to eight hours, so it works on my skin, I'm happy with it. Some people say it gives a juvenile vibe with the sweetness, and I can see that maybe kind of playful, but if you want something different than what you have in your collection, try this out here. I like it. Definitely pick this out. I like the bottle itself, it's cool with the green, like, like light green and dark green here. Definitely check it out. You will stand out differently whether you wear it to work or just have this scent in your car. All these fragrances are great to have in your car as a scent. I would love my car to smell like any one of these fragrances. So, my number one is Crypto Mint. Ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching another fragrance video. If you like fragrance uh, reviews and free fragrance giveaways, why not show your support by clicking that red subscribe button. Check out this video here and here. This is just my uh, three cents for my ride. What are your three cents and what's your car? Leave it down below in the description. Definitely subscribe to the channel for more content. I'll see you guys in the next one. Be safe. Bye.